Alright, today we are looking at this Percy Nobleman Complete Beard Care Kit. I uh, wanted to save the packaging, even though I've been using this for uh, a little over a week now, just so you can see. It, it is some inexpensive, thin, crinkly gift box packaging like you would find in a department store around Christmas time when they're selling stuff that the department stores don't typically sell if you know what I mean. It's not bad, it's not good. It's uh, it's just kind of thin, whatever, gifty packaging. It's alright. It is what it is, right? Um, within it, you've got your plastic little case. It, it's set up as a gift set. This, this blatantly looks like a gift set from a department store to me. And I'm not saying that makes it good or bad. Um, I'm just saying that that is what it is. Um, starting with this comb thing, the comb's okay. It's kind of kind of weird in that, like, to hold the comb, it, uh, until it gets a little bit of lubrication on it from the products, it's actually really hard to deploy the comb. But actually, it's all right. Um, you know, thin little folding comb there that you can, I don't know, use looks cool um, personally for me I guess I would prefer a brush for beard care but this comb is pretty decent and it takes up very little space so other than sometimes being a little hard to open the comb that's included is alright um, got four different products here and if you ask me that's about one product too many for average day-to-day -day stuff but it's alright starting with the beard wash um, the beard wash seems nice. It's relatively um, unoffensive in terms of odor. It doesn't seem to irritate my skin, and uh, it seems like it washes. It it seems decent. I'm uh, relatively happy with the beard wash overall. Um, now from here, uh, jump over to the beard softener. These two are the ones that I've actually been keeping in the shower. It's a little bit, the directions on these are not great. As near as I can tell, I think you're meant to go from the beard wash, which I use in the shower, to the beard softener, which I also use in the shower, under the same concept as going from shampoo to conditioner. For, for those who use both a, a separate shampoo and a conditioner to me this is like this is the beard shampoo this is the beard conditioner if you're into that two-step process because uh, it does not really say on the packaging or the bottles in what order to use these in so I uh, will wash my beard with the beard wash I will put the beard softener in like I would put conditioner on my hair don't use it every day depending on if I'm in a hurry and those are the two that I've been using in the shower then it gets to the last two products where honestly you know I've I'm not into 10 step processes so we're uh, we're going backwards in terms of how often I use this this is the beard conditioning oil and it seems okay, except maybe the odor is a bit strong on it, and it doesn't smell bad. Not that I can convey that to you, but like you don't want to use too much of this, the conditioning oil. So when I get out of the shower, I might apply a small amount of this. As near as I can guess from the limited directions. This says apply to your clean, freshly washed beard. So I assume, okay, so I wash and soften. I get out of the shower and I put some of this on because it seems like it would be counterproductive to wash this out. Both, both of these products say to leave in for a moment or so and then wash it out. So I put this in, I wash it out. I put this in and I wash it out. I get out of the shower I apply just a small amount of the conditioning oil if if I'm in the mood. Um, not very much because the odor is on the strong side on this. Uh, it was very evident to my wife. And that's about as far as I get. I've only looked 
a little bit at this um, beard balm that they include. I've used just the tiniest, tiniest amount because truthfully that is one step too many for me. Um, for a four step process for taking care of my beard, I mean, I just don't, I never put in more than one step, more than just buying a beard wash and using it. So four steps is too many for me. I honestly can't picture using the beard balm other than maybe, maybe if I'm getting, if I'm in a wedding, I mean, I'm already married, but if I'm in somebody's wedding, I'm the best man or I'm a groomsman, and I'm trying to look my absolute best, maybe I will take the extra time to try to apply the beard balm, which will help to uh, sculpt and sort of shape the beard more, sort of like a, a pomade. Um, outside of a special event, uh, day to day, it is too much work. I already don't really like using the conditioning oil after hopping out of the shower, but I've been trying to just to kind of get a feel for the kit. I use a little bit. It's okay. Um, for the most part, these two are my favorites. The beard wash, the beard softener. They kind of seem to work. I apologize. I'm not showing my beard in the video, but I haven't trimmed it up nice or anything, so I don't I don't want to be on video. I'm just telling you my opinion. Um, overall, these two products seem pretty good. This stuff's okay. This stuff is fine, but it's it's like too much. Um, but maybe I would skip this and use a little bit of this to try to keep the frizz and the flyers down if I was going to be in somebody's wedding photos or something. Combs all right. Overall, it's not a bad set. Um, overall, I, I've been using it, trying to use it steady for going on two weeks, and uh, it seems all right. I I like it well enough. The thin plastic packaging that it comes in makes for a good enough uh, gift set. It's all right. It's a decent little <laughs> decent little gift set, department store style. The products seem all right. And uh, honestly, if, if I'm being completely honest, I would probably buy, when this runs out, there's a good chance that I would buy the beard wash again. Like if they sell a bigger bottle of it, I, I'd probably buy it. It's nice to have something to rinse the beard out with. Maybe the beard softener too. I might be willing to purchase a larger container of the beard softener. And then I'm really not too sure, I mean this balm is going to last me for a decade because literally only going to use that for special occasions and the conditioning oil is just a little bit overly fragrant unless you just use the tiniest bit. It's a little bit difficult or unclear how to know from the limited directions exactly what the right way to use that. And that's coming from me as a caveman who just kind of usually lets my beard do whatever it wants to do. So take that for what it is, but um, I think it's a good set. Uh, great for like to try it out to see if you like one or all of the products. And uh, I'm happy that I tried it. I'd, I'd probably get more stuff from this brand again overall. So I would say it's good.